Hey yo everyone, please look at the video and Neil Blake's on right now. <laughs> After the longest wait, I'm telling you guys, like, y'all have no idea how long I've been waiting for this comeback. Like, first of all, y'all saw the title, Wiki Mickey's Siesta. Like, <laughs> let me tell you something, I am so excited to check this out because, I mean, Wiki Mickey... The most underrated girl group that I stand. Like, I'm seriously, guys. Like, y'all know because if you're watching this video, you're a Keeling like me. If you're watching this and you're just a subscriber, you're like, Wiki Mickey, like, I'll watch it, but I have no idea who the heck they are. Stand them! That's all I gotta say. <laughs> just like, <laughs> like, I know people know them for, like, at least know the name, but from, like, Yu Jung and maybe Doyen, stuff like that. Maybe another member here and there and stuff like that, but I'm just saying, like, they are so criminally underrated, dog. It is so sad. I watched the reality show. I listened to their discography and stuff like that. I actually just bought one of their albums from FYE. Like, my local FYE has been doing really good as far as, like, getting all kinds of different artists and they're in the, the K-pop album section and stuff like that. And I had to buy that album. And... I'm so happy I did, because it has, like, oh my goodness, so many good songs. But anyway, <laughs> but, yeah, their discography is so good, and they're still underrated. And this comeback, though, they had three comebacks last year, and now they're going to wait until Thanksgiving time, or the week before Thanksgiving, to release a new comeback. And... That's over a year's wait, and it's just sad that those three comebacks last year, they just got lower and lower sales each comeback. Oh boy, and what frustrated me a little bit at first was about how apparently their new music video is not on the WikiMiki YouTube channel, but on Fantagio's YouTube channel. It's like, Fantagio, what the heck are you doing? You're... But as it turns out... I'm guessing, as it turns out, like, the channel has, like, almost a million subscribers now, which is more than what Wiki Mickey's channel has, so I'm like, okay, maybe this could work out and stuff like that. I don't know, I mean, I don't know how to feel at this point, but one thing I'm excited for, it's got quite a bit of views in just a few days. I'm checking this out a few days late, and I apologize for that, but there's actually a couple of videos that I might upload after this that are even later than that, so... I need to stop being so late. But anyway, this video is getting way too rambly. I'm trying to do it as one take as possible. Let's just not waste any more time. Let's get in this. Three, two, one. Hit the playback. Oh. I'm sorry for that long intro, by the way. That just turned into a bit of a rant. <laughs> They're just so underrated, dude. It's not even funny. She's Suyan, though, dude. Everyone. I cannot... I'm liking this beat already. Holy crap to you, Jung. <laughs> of course, everyone knows and loves you, Jung. And Doyan, too. Because, you know, IOI. I'm just so happy that, you know, a few members are getting their time to shine bit by bit nowadays. Through little bits and pieces of stuff. Lucy is such an underrated visual dog, and Say too. They all are just so gorgeous, dude. Okay, this is a very simple video, but I hope it catches on. What, <laughs> dude? Rena. See what I mean, dude? Oh, dude! Why did it take them this long to do this comeback, dude? I was not doing the backpack dance, don't worry. Oh, dude! Oh, that's pretty! Hey, Crystal. Say, dude. Lucy. Oh, my goodness. 
this. Oh, they're all sleeping. Lula, Xi'an, Dillion, Sei, just everyone, dude. Main vocal, Suyan, dude. Dude, the visuals in this video, I love how they did their makeup and hair. You jog! Okay. <laughs> And the clothes and everything, dude. It's a simple video, but... It just shows their beauty, dude. Oh, dude, that hair on Suyun, yes. Them highlights on the hair. Lua, dude, and that rainbow lighting, nice. That cape, though. <laughs> oh! Breaking the pearls. Oh, dude, they're handling fireworks. Okay. Oh, fireworks. Okay. Oh, that guitar, dude. <laughs> Blowing them candles out. I'm happy that it's getting some good views, dude. I just hope this translates to... Oh, they're taking off. I just hope that translates to, like, at least decent sales. Oh, dude. That's smiling, dude. Don't ever stop smiling, everyone, especially you, John. I know you had a hiatus earlier this year, so... <laughs> hey. Doing a little cheer. Nice. Oh, dude. That was so nice. It's simple, yet so nice. Siesta. People need to stop taking siestas over Wiki Mickey, I'm just saying. Alright, dude, well, just simple video, simple, like, visual, simple video with all the different simplicities and stuff like that, but point done in that video right there. Just their beauty and the, their visual, just they're all such visuals, dude. Their beauty shown in that video with their hair and their makeup and their outfit and stuff like that. It was a very simple video and stuff like that. And I feel like they did that on purpose because like, I feel like it was a more casual, laid back type of video. And I felt they were really happy doing that type of a video too. Where they're just acting natural, acting simple and stuff like that. You know, just like them. I feel like that was definitely a good different experience for them versus their other music videos. Doing, you know, role playing and type of stuff like that. The more flashy visuals and stuff like that. There were, and the dance sequences, of course, were very lovely as well. I, I know they released a behind the scenes stuff. I haven't watched it yet, but I'm definitely going to watch it now because it looks like they were having some good fun in there. Shooting out the fireworks and, you know, doing all that they were doing and stuff like that in the video. <laughs> I wonder if they shot that in one day. That'd be pretty interesting if it did. But anyway, um,. Yeah, the, it was a simple video, and I can't but feel like it was a simple video because of the fact that, you know, they had three comics last year with pretty decent videos and stuff like that. You know, obviously of a higher scale than this and stuff like that. And they just get low, got lower and lower results each comeback. And it just sands me to think that, okay, let's just make the music videos simple. That way, even if we get a small amount in sales, it'll be a decent return. And I just find that so sad, especially the fact that over the past year, Astro, their Sunbay group, their boy group, has absolutely exploded, dude. I mean, they appeared on Kingdom and stuff like that and got pretty good recognition because of that. And now their album sales are like, uh, th their last two albums got certified platinum, correct me if I'm wrong. I know one of their albums has sold almost like half a million copies, which is amazing considering they're from a small company. That being said, though, I mean, the fact that they were on Kingdom, that being said, we need a Queendom Season 2, and we need Wiki Mickey on there. Like, if we get a Queendom Season 2, I want all kinds of underrated girl groups on there, dude. I want Wiki Mickey, I want, you know, all those different underrated girl groups that stand, and what other people stand that have not gotten a full chance to shine in Korea to go on there. And I could say, and I could definitely see and tell you 
that Wicked Mickey will definitely be up there in the ranks. Because you see the talent and the, their videos and stuff like that, including this one. Their vocals are good. I feel like their dancing didn't shine that much in the video, but I'll have to see the live performance and stuff like that. But you saw all the different stuff they do in variety shows and all that type of stuff. Seriously, Wiggy Mickey Mohe, go watch it. The reality show. You'll get to learn more about them as a group through that more than any other thing that they've done. Because they barely get invited to all these reality shows and stuff like that. I know they were on Knowing Brothers and stuff like that. I don't know, I forgot if there was the whole group and stuff like that. Maybe a few members, but... And I don't think they even did that much for them with the variety, as far as variety sense and stuff like that, but... Wiki Mickey Mohe... I wish there was a Wiki Mickey Mohe Season 2, dog. Like... <sighs> people need to know about this group, dude. They've been around for four years, and they still haven't had a breakthrough. <clears throat> I just hope the right song, the right promotions, the right everything will come through, dude. Can they have a viral moment like Brave Girls and The Bone did this year, dog? Can they have a breakthrough moment with this song? Can they have something happen where they get the recognition they deserve, dude? I just don't want them to continuously be underrated or just be known as, you know, Doyeon and Yoo Jung and friends. And even they themselves are kind of underrated, dude. Now, like, Yoo Jung is basically just known for her bold dancing and stuff like that. Doyeon's known for her beauty and stuff like that, which, I mean, they're both pluses in that department because it gets some recognition. But I want them to be known for more than just that. And I want the members to be known for just everything they are, dude. That was... I'm sorry, this is just turning into a rant video at this point, but... Point being, that was a nice video. Their talent shown and their singing and dancing and all that, dude. Just like, I mean, it may not seem like much to some people, but I see the potential, dog. I see the potential in them. And just, they're so charming, dude. And it was just a nice, comforting video to watch, dude. Simple, but I could see why it was simple. And... I like this getting some good views. Got like over 5 million views in like 3 days, which is awesome. And yeah, just please y'all support this comeback. Stream it, buy the album, vote for them on some music shows, all music shows that they're nominated in. I don't know if they're even going to get a win because we got them competing against One Us, Twice, Monster X. They're going to get robbed again, I just know it. But still, vote as much as you can, dog. Just... I want them to succeed, dog. This is why I don't like standing underrated groups or checking out underrated groups. Because I don't want to stand them and they go nowhere, dude. But Wiki Mickey is definitely an exception. Because, I mean, I loved Doyoung and Yoo Jung since IOI. And I ended up... As you can see, really loving Wiki Mickey as a whole because they introduced me to them and stuff like that. Of course, I checked out their debut, I checked out their comeback after that, I checked out their last few comebacks, and I full on love Wiki Mickey, dude. They're the most underrated group I stand, and it's so good, dog. They're so good. Okay, I'm gonna end this video right now because holy crap, I've been filming for 14 minutes. Okay. This is basically a rant video more than a reaction at this point, but anyway, just my opinions. What are your guys' opinions? Put it down in the comments down below, and yeah. This is Blaster. You're watching Annual Blaster, so to the next video, drop us, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more. And follow me on Twitter if you want to. Link in the description, as always, and you'll have a great day. God bless you. Thank you for watching, and peace out, my scouts! Holy crap, this is going to be such a long video. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm going to keep it all in, though, because... Bleh.